A beautiful photo sent in on our Facebook wall by Reinhardt. Not a cloud in the sky for sunrise. You can see Mount McLaughlin peeking out there in the distance. Expecting to see more cloudless skies today. And temperatures warming due to a lot of sunshine, high pressure building in. Not a good combination now that fire season has officially begun in Jackson and Josephine County. That fire danger level has been upgraded to moderate now. So what does that mean? Here's a look at some of the restrictions now in place for that moderate fire danger level. Fireworks are no longer allowed. Debris burning is limited to barrels and you must have a permit. There are restrictions to campfires. They recommend that you carry a shovel and bucket and it's actually a requirement if you are going to be camping. Smoking restrictions are also in place and tracer ammunition is no longer allowed for a full list of these restrictions and a breakdown as well as numbers you can call if you have any fire safety or fire season questions, you can head to our website, kdrv.com, and click on weather links. Well, it is going to be dry the next couple of days, and pollens, wouldn't be surprised if we start to see those pollens climb again, especially in the afternoons when those winds start to pick up. Trees and grasses pollinating, and we are at that moderate level. But like I said, it is going to be dry for the next several days, so I wouldn't be surprised if that starts to climb up a little bit and you start sneezing and sniffling just a little bit more. Grants Pass yesterday struggled to warm up, really only got to 74 degrees, whereas Medford climbed into the 80s, 77 degrees in Klamath Falls. Today is going to be even warmer, expecting mid to upper 80s on the west side. Brookings will see the Checo effect warm them up to the mid 80s, expecting it to be fairly breezy at the coast. Actually, a gale warning is in effect there. And on the east side, some areas flirting with that 80 degree mark. We're going to reach the 80s on the east side and even the 90s on the west side for the warmest days of the year. 